So my Walmart pen and gear video seemed to be popular. So I'll just do a little bit of that. This is uh, my Hobonichi Techo. I'm kind of using this as a journal, but tomorrow I have it set up as a planner. So there's just a little thing there. This is as a journal page, this is as a planner page. This is my functional junk journal. It's got an old uh, moleskin notebook in there. And um, th this, it's literally a junk journal. This, the, a functional junk journal for me is a notebook that I repurpose. And I usually cover the my, what I had written on it with sticky notes and stickers with new information on it. So that's why it's so chunky. This is the popular girl. This is the Walmart um, pen and gear undated daily planner. I use this, I call this my PRN planner or as needed. Um, so I started it in March and then whenever I finish it is when I finish it. I don't use it every day. That is, let me just get to a blank page. More towards the back. Here we go. So you've got you. You can write the date, circle the day of the week. You have a daily goal. You have priorities. You can kind of do like you know what you need to do for morning, afternoon, and evening, or you can cover it up and make it for something else. You have this note page. Um, I've done a video where I've done like different layouts. You can make a timeline here. Um, I use this a lot for our daily meeting notes. Um, you can also, I also use this for shopping lists, so it's very versatile. And I like that you get two pages per day on here. So the only downside to this is that it ends on this page and then you miss the note page. But that's not the end of the world. I keep it in a um, passport size traveler notebook cover and when I'm rooming these are in one of my pockets because I never know when I'm going to need this to look up an extension or something. And then, oh, this is a memo pad. It goes in the traveler's notebook. Anything that um, contains like uh, patient information might get written here, like if I'm on the phone or something, I have to write stuff down. And then at the end of the day, I just tear it out, put it in the appropriate shred bin. So I put that there. But if you are looking for like an easy, inexpensive uh, little planner, uh, no frills, I recommend this. There's no monthlies, no weeklies, it's just dailies. And um, it works out pretty well for me. I call this my PRN planner. This I was gonna use as a mini cousin, but it didn't really work. Um, I wound up just getting a Jibun Techo Biz for my weekly planner, but um, I've been used, I've been like haphazardly using this, so. Um, I told myself not to buy another one in January. I may or may not listen to that, but I um, told myself if I'm gonna get another Hobonichi Techo or Hobonichi Cousin to wait until April, because right now I have the Daily Duo starting in July and that'll go to June of 2025. So yeah, this page I journal, this page I'm kind of using as a planner, you know, this, this notebook, I'm kind of just doing what I want with it. And I, I'm not sure if I spelled develop right, but I don't really care. The only person reading it is me. So, but yeah. And uh, you don't have to have a fancy cover for your... Uh, I actually was bought this cover to use uh, with another notebook. Uh, but the other notebook was too big, so... But the daily planners fit in here perfectly. So if you have a passport TN co uh, cover, it can go in here. So, yeah. Walmart daily planner for the win. 
<laughs> Have a good day, everybody.